for me, gamification, we're looking to use it as a tool um, to bring their teams together under one roof, um, to create a, a sense of community, to celebrate successes, both big successes, right, our big goals, but also all of the little things that go into getting to those big goals. Um, I also mentioned that we have a global team, right? And being that we have that global team, there's a lot of really great things going on in APJ or in EMEA that the team in, in the Americas might not see, right? So we're, we're looking to use gamification as a way to kind of break down some of those silos and, and use it as a, a mechanism to turn all of the great things that we're doing into global successes, um, right? So the reps in America, if somebody's lighting up the leaderboard in EMEA, it's going to cause them to ask questions about, you know, what are they doing? How are they doing that, right? So again, sense of community and culture and building that um, in this new workplace that we all have is, is really paramount to me going into this year. And then tracking KPIs, right? Um, those KPIs that we're all monitoring our teams by are, you know, leading indicators of successes, failures, problems in the moment, what needs to be fixed. Um, but oftentimes, at least for me, maybe this is me telling myself, but for me, like monitoring those goals can sometimes seem like, seem like a burden. Um, and to the reps, especially when they're at home, can kind of feel like they're being micromanaged a little bit. Right. So we're looking to use gamification and bringing those KPIs to the forefront through, like Matt said, through a, a, a platform that is fun, that is engaging, that the reps want to see their KPIs through. Um, you know, we're, we're looking at kind of up level the team and again, foster that sense of fun, collaboration and community.